Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to December 1st, 2020. And we've been having a bit of an earthquake parade over the last 48 hours as we had a 6.4 hit in Argentina. We had a 6.4 earthquake hit in Russia. And then just a little while ago, we've had a 6.3 hit in the Aleutian Islands, east southeast of Nikolsky, Alaska. And so buckle up, 2020. Just keeps on 2020-ing, and we have a big Jupiter and Saturn grand conjunction where the two will meet up in the sky. It happens every 20 years, but this time they're doing it with Pluto, and Pluto is probably more than meets the eye. You know what I'm saying? Um, and so with all the gas giants on the same side, we're on the lookout for big earthquakes, big volcano eruptions, and general wackiness for the rest of 2020. And then if you want to throw on top of that, the most active sun we've seen in at least three years, that means things are just going to keep on getting cray cray, bay bay. And yeah, there is direct connection between solar activity, weather, space weather, earthquakes and volcanoes. Because you know, the core of our earth is like a little star, a little sun if you will, and everything is interconnected, including our solar system, the planets, and everything inside. And so, get ready to celebrate while playing, you know, the best defense you've ever played your whole life for the rest of December. And checking out this map over on the Earth Null, not surprised that we've seen this low pressure system move from over here where the earthquake happened, and now it is over here. It's almost like a planet. And so we had the earthquake over here, probably around the time the low pressure system was moving past it. It will continue to move to the east, and we will stay on super high red asteroid fight club 2020 alert all year long. Look at that pressure gradient, man. That is super low. And that is super high. So I hope you do have a super fantastic December to close out 2020 and all your dreams come true. And no, it does not appear that a tsunami is expected. This was the Sumatra volcano eruption that happened also a few hours ago. It was a major pyroclastic flowian volcano eruption. And so, uh, yeah, dude, it's going to keep on getting biblical. New Testament, or the newest Testament style, if you will. And with Saturn and Capricorn for the next 16 days, and Jupiter and Capricorn for the next 19 days, the last degree of a sign is always very energetic, shall we say. And it could be a bit stressful. So hang in there, and in between there, we will have a total solar eclipse happening. On December 14th so know that a lot of crazy crap is probably gonna go down as we changed over from Capricorn which represents the old system status quo and Aquarius which represents the future so yeehaw and buckle up and also I do a fundraiser every single month as your planetary defense commander and for whatever reason uh, the month of November, my hackers and digital overlords have been extremely, extremely, extremely upset with me. And so they've tightened all the screws on everything. And so if you would like to contribute or donate, and this will be for the ninth year of Thor News as well, I would suggest sending in an actual physical USPS letter. T. Lewison, 5430, Birdwood Road, number 416, Houston, Texas, 77096. So if you want to do it for my... Ninth year of Thor news, if for all the all that I did it in 2020 or uh, the eight years that I've been doing this or for my birthday, which is the 19th or for Christmas or for whatever reason you want to contribute to keep me. And remember, I'm the only guy in the truth community who hasn't been selling a grand solar minimum, who wasn't selling Trump as a savior, who wasn't telling everybody that it's the end times, who wasn't telling everybody everything's the mark of the beast. I'm like an independent guy. In the truth community and i like doing that man uh, and don't believe in any politicians all political parties suck bro anywho 
if you want to support, I'd appreciate it. But I know these are challenging, trying times for everybody. And December is definitely going to be super weird. All right. God bless everyone. Stay cool. And super thank you to all of Asteroid Fight Club out there. For helping me make it through eight years. Definitely Mike and the Texas Angel. JB, Cody, Rose, and everybody out there for all your love and support. You guys are super fantastic. I love you. I'm going to stick around. I hope you do the same. God bless everyone. Let's have a great Christmas. Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, Happy New Year, Royal Conjunction, and all those fantastic things. Yeehaw.